Just kidding, guys. But today, we are going to Otaka Fest. <laughs> I don't even know how to say it. Otaka Fest. And I'm pretending to be a real-life anime. And we're also going to get some interviews. I've just been, like, really into the anime scene. So I'm going to try to, like, be a little anime girly and, like, buy some cute anime girly stuff. So let's get it. Let's get it. Let's go inside. What are you dressed up as today? Gail from uh, Baldur's Gate 3. No, I think you're mistaken. The name's Gail of Waterdeep. Uh, why'd you choose that? Because, honestly, I look enough like him that I don't have to wear a wig. <laughs> That's it. Really, it's like simple and easy. Easy, easy, incredibly easy. I'm Straw Hat Luffy. And I'm myself. <laughs> well, who's Straw Hat Luffy? Straw Hat Luffy is the main character of One Piece. He's a rubber man. <laughs> And you came as yourself, so. But you have a medal. What is that for? We got third place in the Smash Bros. doubles as Ganondorf. And for those of you who know, it's a pretty hard feat to accomplish, but uh, <laughs> we're coming for first next year. We're coming for first. All right, who am I here with today? Ozzy Oz the Virus, graphic designer, one of the coldest out here. And I see your shirt. What is that? I mean, if you know, you know. <laughs> Do you watch? Do you watch hentai? Uh, used to. Now the real thing's better. What, what did you used to watch? Shit, when I was young, I didn't even know. I was just clicking. Whatever. Just clicking. Yeah, whatever came up. All the scam ad. <laughs> if you could have any superpower, what would it be? Naruto Shadow Clone Jutsu. What is that? <laughs> Shit, a lot of me at once. Multiply myself. I think that could be so useful in everyday life and just hilarious to fuck with people. Get everything done. I could fuck myself. Literally. The ability to speak any language that I want, because I only speak one right now. I mean, obviously flight. Being able to avoid US-1 would be just the best thing in the world down here in Miami. Yeah. Right, who are you dressed up as today? I'm um, Doki from Demon Slayer. She's a badass bitch. Like, I love her. She's hot. She is like, she gets what she wants and she's just like a little bit psycho, which I can really look up to. A little psycho? A little psycho. Do you feel that anime is a big part of your personality? God, being in the late 30s, back with Toonami and Adult Swim being a very key part of my TV uh, schedule, yes, I would say that. So, very much so. So why do you feel like you like the culture so much? Like, what about it? It's really welcoming. A lot of other cultures and a lot of other communities can be... I mean, elitism exists everywhere, but the anime community has almost always been very welcoming, very easy to make friends in. I love your outfit. Who am I here with today? Uh, Hu Tao from Genshin Impact. Who are you? <laughs> Quick, do something! Ooh, is that your favorite anime? Um, it's a video game. It's definitely one of my favorite ones right now. And do you feel that anime is a big part of your personality? Yes and no. It's definitely one of the things that helps me bond with a lot of different people, but there are a lot of things outside of anime that I have an interest in. Who am I here with today? I am Lemon Lee Autumn. Are you hot in it right now? Because it's so hot out. Yes, very. I actually have a fan in my mouth. Oh my god. Oh my god, she got a fan in her mouth. And if you could have any superpower, what would it be? Superpower? I'd love to fly. Like, be able to make people say yes to anything. Okay, like like manipulation in a way, like, like you could say anything? Yeah. Peace. That's my superpower. I want to bring peace to the world. Most people say fly, you know? Yeah, because well, I'm already fly. I wish I could control animals. Like, make them, like, do my bidding and whatnot. Like, any animal. Think about it for a second. How many squirrels do you see on your day-to-day? -day? A lot of squirrels. A lot of squirrels. How scared would you be if a lot of squirrels started taking like shit out of your car and like stealing your rims and shit? Probably scared. You, know? you would be really scared. Yeah. And when you go to the police and tell them a bunch of squirrels took parts out of my car, do you think they'll believe you? Probably not. Probably not. That's actually a pretty smart. <laughs> okay, so you would like control animals to like do bad shit? Not only bad shit, you know, I might, I might end world hunger. How are you gonna, oh, wait, how are you gonna end world hunger with controlling animals? Though? They're gonna eat all the humans. You know what I'm saying? So the world's just gonna be all animals? Yeah. So you're just like an animal person? And me. And me. So you're gonna be like, like, like Tarzan type? No, not like Tarzan. I'll still be human and whatnot. I'll still like pay taxes and whatnot, but you know what I'm saying? I'll be how are you gonna pay taxes when there's no society? Not just Kill them all. And if you could date one anime character, who would it be? Nico Robin. 
Anyone over the age of 21. <laughs> Okay, why for you? Nico Robin is like very stoic and like mature, but also silly and goofy. And like, I really appreciate that about her. I feel like we'll be able to spend some like really fire quality time together. Fire quality time. And which anime character would you date? I would date Zero Two from Darling and the Franks. Why? Uh, she's a sweetheart. She's a babe. She's got a banging body, but she's got like a loving heart, and I could I could fuck with that. I need a lover girl. A lover girl. <laughs> Which anime character would you want to date? It might be crazy what I'm about to say. It might be crazy what I'm about to say. I don't think Ghetto was all that wrong. I don't think he was wrong. I think he was kind of justified. And I think, I think I could fix him. So you date yourself? Yeah, I'm a little narcissistic. But I feel like a lot of people here today have said they would date themselves. And I'm like, oh, okay. They said they would multiply themselves to fuck themselves. I'm not saying I disagree with them. <laughs> what anime character would you want to date? Nanami from Jujutsu Kaisen. Why? He's just a perfect man. He's polite, you know, he looks out for kids. He puts them before himself. He's a real gentleman. Okay, guys, we are finally done. That was so fun. Thank you, Otaku Fest, for having us. Just kidding, we bought it. And yeah, I had a great time. People here are just way nicer. They're just way nicer. They say yes to being interviewed, and they're just way better. Like, we're definitely gonna be at more festivals. Let us know in the comments what your favorite part was and what festivals you guys have been coming up in your city. Where should we go next? All right, love you. <laughs> go shop our merch too. <laughs>